1962, the nuclear power demonstration, or NPD reactor, near Ralston, Ontario, became Canada's first nuclear power generating reactor for the people of Ontario. NPD operated for 25 years and also served as a training center for the nuclear industry. Under the direction of Atomic Energy of Canada Limited, a federal crown corporation, Canadian Nuclear Laboratories now has the responsibility for decommissioning NPD. In situ decommissioning has been selected as a way to reduce Canada's nuclear legacy liabilities at the NPD site. In situ decommissioning means leaving the remaining reactor components and systems inside the reinforced concrete structure and filling it entirely with a flowable form of concrete called grout. The NPD facility is well suited for this strategy because the reactor and components are already deep underground. Due to the distances to the nearest concrete suppliers, a batch mixing plant will be constructed on the NPD site to supply the project with grout and concrete. The below grade structure containing the reactor vessel and systems and components will be encased with grout. The above ground structures will be demolished and the debris placed in the below grade structure previously occupied by the electrical generating equipment. The grouted structure will then be capped with concrete and an engineered barrier. In situ decommissioning will isolate the remaining radiologic inventory inside the below grade structure. Canadian Nuclear Laboratories will monitor the site for a minimum of 100 years a period of time referred to as institutional control. Remaining in clear view at the site will be the iconic red and white ventilation stack. It has become a favorite roosting spot for chimney swifts, a species at risk in North America. Leaving the stack in place is the best alternative for protecting the species. Canadian Nuclear Laboratories is committed to protecting the environment, our workers, and the public.